Vision. Vision. Namika. Namika. Sights from beyond. Well, Eternal actually um, started off playing um, a mixture of uh, hardcore, trash metal, and a bit of uh, death metal as well back then. And then uh, slowly, slowly we progressed to uh, playing death metal. Then, uh, and then along the way, we sort of like flirt or <laughs> with uh, other some kinds of uh, influences um, like progressive metal that kind of thing and I guess uh, at the moment it's a mixture of uh, both death metal, melodic metal and progressive metal and um, some experimental stuff that kind of thing uh, so basically that's uh, yeah, that's, that's what they tell you is uh. My guitar influences uh, when I first started out playing guitar or tried to learn the guitar my f believe it or not my first inspiration was uh, actually Jimi Hendrix yeah Jimi Hendrix and Rudolf Schenker of Scorpions uh. that was like you know um, all of his uh, black and white flying V guitar and then um, it was uh, after that another inspiration at that time that wants me to pick up the guitar is uh, Monkey Dahl of uh, Left Handed Monkey Dahl and uh, the other guitarist Samad uh, Arao Samad yeah this this was my uh, those were my early, early influences uh, or inspirations uh. Then after that, I get uh, um, really serious on guitar. It was after I listened to uh, Jimi Hendrix. And that was like my really first influence. All those pentatonic blues and stuff. Jimi Hendrix, Ulrich Roth, uh, known as uh, Uli Roth. Then my Shen Michael Schenker, these three guys. Uh. And then uh, along the way, with um, other guitarists like Ingwe Mumstein, James Murphy, and um, you know all those uh, Shatner stuffs, and um, then later be on, later bit on some some other guitarists uh, like uh, John Sykes and uh, Aidan Smith for Five Maiden. Both of this is uh, mainly influenced me to play those uh, white vibrato kind of stuff, uh, kind of licks. Yeah. So basically, that's it. Uh. Uh, I don't have many gears, except for uh, probably two guitars and a few effects pedal, which I've been using for like, for many years, or donkey years. Um, my main one at the moment is uh, this uh, Headless guitar. Um, I did. It was. Uh, I think I got it in 2017. Um, because at that time, um, I sort of like just recovered from uh, what do you call it, couple tunnel syndrome, and uh, and I'm still having arthritis, which affects a lot of my playing. So I'm looking for a guitar that I can really play um, easily. So uh, I did. After I did some internet searching, that kind of thing, um, I found out that this guitar is uh, quite suitable for me. That was uh, that was until I read um, an interview with uh, Alan Nosworth, the the, the uh, jazz fusion maestro, on the reason why he um, he plays the uh, headless guitar. Yeah, so basically. The main inf inspiration for me to play a headless guitar other than like for easy playing is uh, Eleanor Swerve and also Paul Masvidal of uh, Signing. Uh. Then apart from this, uh, so this is my main guitar actually. Uh, basically for all those uh, 
this standard kind of thing because I'm currently I'm playing in a few few bands so and, and some of the bands are using different tuning so this is a tuning on a D standard and um, other than that is uh, this is the this is uh, oops this is another guitar which uh, actually belongs to my younger brother-in-law uh, he's not playing it anymore so I sort of like took it over from him or so-called <laughs> permanent loan this is this this X is uh, basically uh, down tuned to B B standard so for the bands that playing like for example Ethereal and uh, maybe Cardiac, ne Cardiac Necropsy this is the main X lah. for recording wise um, I use this for the um, especially for Ethereal or Ethereal uh, latest uh, coming album I'm using this for the rhythms while the leads and solos and thing I'll be using the uh, Headless guitar this is uh, oh yeah by the way the Headless guitar is uh, is using uh, passive pickups you know so yeah passive pickups sorry <laughs> and uh, for this guitar it's uh, fitted with EMG's active pickups so good for like you know riffing and rhythm so uh, these are my two main guitars and other than that I have like one strat but it's not restrained yet and uh, it's like in my bedroom <laughs> okay and um, uh, let me see what else I have like oh okay this little thing but you know this is uh, the, the uh, what do you call it um, zoom ms50g multi storm which uh, most of the time if I go for, go for like rehearsal jamming or even kicks this is the pilot I used to because I'm too lazy to bring other things and this is easy so I just uh, use it I mean the the, uh, the voltage uh, I mean for the uh, power I just uh, use 9 volt battery so it's very very easy it's small and uh, and it give, gives out good sound other than that I'm um, is this um, <laughs> this big thing <laughs> This has been like since uh, I think 2009 or 2010. I bought this, but it's very heavy. When I went for touring like few years ago, it was this thing was like so heavy and you know, but it it, it works well. So sometimes uh, if I'm bringing guitar at home or anything or, or do some recording, I will use this. Uh. Um, this. And normally for recordings, uh, home recordings, everything is uh, is there the um, the Pro XT Live, or I will straight be using the VST on my Cubase uh. So that's about it. Uh. Ethereal upcoming release is. Uh, I think should be fingers crossed lah by end of this year I guess so far the uh, drums and uh, guitars have been recorded and it got halted because of the uh, current COVID-19 circuit breaker so after that we will continue doing the other tracks like vocal tracks, bass tracks will contain 12, 12 songs some old songs reworks some new songs uh, yeah wait for it coming soon yeah <laughs> last words I'd like to thank Al Hazret for having me for this uh, Visionomicon interview Arif thanks, thanks a lot 
I don't normally do video interviews because I, to be honest, I'm uh, video shy. <laughs> I'm not used like to like do interviews, you know, video everything. So yeah, and uh, to to all my uh, friends out there, uh, support Visionomicon and uh, support Ethereal and also the bands I'm playing with, like Cardiac Necropsy and uh, Wicked. And yeah. Thanks a lot, thanks. Watching Vision Nomicon. Vision Nomicon.